last one, Isaac. There's a switch in atmosphere control to restart the oxygen recycling. Once oh, the air's clean, you can oh. get into food storage. Sneeze. I'm so sorry. I've reading these reports. The crew all began having mass hallucinations. And... Well, I just saw my brother. On a security monitor. And that's just not possible. Seems like we all have, uh... People that we think are dead that aren't dead. <laughs> well, really are dead. Just, you know, hallucinations. Okay, game. I some I I swear. This pathway would just bring me to the other side, or not? My house full. Not a big deal if I can't get this, uh, since I do have so much. But anyway. This thing could be good. Yeah, because there's a lot of potential with what you could do with Isaac talking with, uh, him responding like, I'm seeing, I believe it's his wife, Nicole, that we're seeing, right? Saw him, he'd be able to say, I've seen my wife on monitors. I... Is there a way to... I think there's a way to look at sub-objectives, right? Okay, it says I have to shard all of them. Thanks, game. Is what's his face still sitting over here? No, he's gone. Hang on, I'm I'm just curious. Actually this is an elevator. Shoot. Forget we'll uh we're just gonna see. I'm curious if he just went to the uh to the tram system. See if he's there. If not, it's okay. You know, he was being told you need to get the cleaner air and all that jazz anyway. You know, this looks like a nice enough place to just relax, so.
my main curiosity is if like if you obviously he was like weakened from breathing in the polluted air so I'm just wondering if like if, if you breathe too much of that in do you become infected is he gonna turn that kind of thing right Oh, you know what I probably could have done since that's not a full mag? I probably could have grabbed it, reloaded, and then picked the thing back up, you know? Oh well. Small loss. Ripper too much, so now let's just move those off. So I'll stack that. Probably can sell more than one. Sell for more, so I am okay with some of those. Some of those. Yeah, we have a lot. I want to meant to do. up on some of these. There we go. Head back to the bench. Okay. I think we will max out the suit. Achievement for maxing out the suit, I'm kind of surprised. too many times. We do have just an abundance of med packs too, so I don't see any reason why we can't get rid of a few of these.
We're gonna go do one more upgrade to the pulse rifle. And then I think I will wrap up this recording session. Good bit more damage, eh? Yeah, I think, uh, <laughs> I think we'll leave that. I think one thing we're gonna do, probably gonna run back and grab a few things. Oh, this is the wrong, wrong one. I don't wanna go to that one. Um, and while we're doing this, I will kind of just use it to wind down the episode. Again, I don't know how long this game is. Uh, we made about three hours of progress. We made about a little over three hours. We're almost at three and a half hours playing. And it's some mighty good progress. Again, I I haven't even looked up like what the general length of this game is. The fact that I'm playing on easy means like this is going really smooth too. I will most likely do the remake on normal and probably the second and third games on normal too. See how I'm feeling. But considering that this has been relatively a cakewalk, I mean, the only. I think I've only had, like, what, one actual death to the enemies, and that was just because, like, I was absolutely swarmed, if I recall. Let's see if there's any other things in here for me. So I'm totally curious how Mercer is able to move around. Like, do the enemies not attack him at all? Like, they don't care because he's connected with them somehow, right? So, uh, but even though they had, like, even though it has been relatively easy, I'm still having fun because it is my first Dead Space experience. And I... I think I'm smart enough not to, like, to, you know, to realize that, hey, I'm the one that chose easy, and this is my fault if the game seems too, too easy, that I'm breezing through it relatively easily. At the very least, like, uh, I think just having the, f the framing of the first game in my in my repertoire, under my boots, uh, just will help me appreciate the remake more. All right. I don't think there should be anything in my inventory that I really care for moving. This should be pretty much fine. Let's go hit the save.
And with that, I can do my final goodbyes here. Uh, once again, shout out to Nikurda for doing the Protogen model. Shout out to the main monkey Funky for the ODST armor. And to Akura for doing the VRM work. Thank you so much, bud. And yeah, I will see you guys soon. I I'm gonna say like again, I don't know how long this game is. That hopefully in my next recording session I can finish the game off. It's been a, it's been a while since I've done a recording session that's gotten to this length. We're almost at the three and a half hour mark. We're gonna hit that in three seconds and three and a half hours. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, ciao for now. Bye.